This lesson is an introduction to the Keyword Explorer tool. Let's get started. The main goals of the Keyword Explorer tool are as follows. To show you how your chosen seed keyword compares to other relevant popular search results, to help you quickly build your keyword lists for different stages of your SEO campaign using the basic and advanced filters, to reduce the average time spent on manual keyword research by up to 90%. Here are some popular use cases when using Keyword Explorer. Finding suitable golden keywords for your seed keyword or topic. Understanding the popularity of your seed keyword in a particular demographic. Gauging the competition for your seed keyword by looking at the leading articles in the SERPs. Helping you fully optimize your content for the SERPs. The Keyword Explorer tool streamlines the process of finding, clustering and optimizing keywords for your content. It also gives you a deeper insight into your keywords through multiple insights and metrics. Now let's take a look at the mechanism behind Keyword Explorer. When you type in a seed keyword into Keyword Explorer, whether it's a keyword search, domain search, or wildcard search, WriterZen uses Google's own API to search through the highest ranked search results from Google's Keyword Database and Google Suggest in order to find keyword clusters that are most relevant to your seed keyword. You are then presented with all the data you need to evaluate your seed keyword. That includes search metrics, trends and domains as well as all the related keywords you may want to consider. You can then use the various filters in Keyword Explorer to filter and sort the data according to your goal, which you can then save to a number of keyword lists in WriterZen. Let's explore the interface. To create a new search, you can access the Keyword Explorer tool via the navigation bar or via the card on the dashboard by clicking the Explore New Keyword link. Inside the Keyword Explorer dashboard, you can type your seed keyword into the search bar. You can also choose a language and location for each individual search or project. And to save some time, you can save any language and location as a default if your target market is generally always the same. You can access your latest projects from the Keyword Explorer card in the main dashboard. Simply click the link to the project you want. And you can access your full search history from the history table inside the Keyword Explorer dashboard, where you'll see more details including keyword, location, language, date created, and status. If your plan includes the team function, you'll also see a column for the owner of the research. And just so you know, your search results will expire in 30 days. This is to protect you from outdated information. Google's data is highly fluctuating, especially at the 30-day mark. So if there's a gap from when you did your research and when you work with the data, the only way to ensure that you're up to date is by starting again. It's for the best. In this lesson, we touched briefly on Keyword Explorer's interface and functionality. In the coming lessons, we'll be taking a deeper dive into the three different types of search this tool can perform for you. A keyword search, a domain search, and a wildcard search. I'll see you there.